Hey everyone! Um, it is 5 o'clock in the morning and I'm getting ready to go to London today because I am going to a London event. I've been invited to see Kylie Jenner because she is the new ambassador for Nip and Fab. Um, I don't even know if I'm going to get to meet her because she's so busy. Um, <laughs> but I'm really, really excited to see Kylie today. And uh, I'm really tired <laughs> because it's going to be a long day ahead. I so I've got to go to London from my university flat and then after the event I have got to go back to uni because I've got a uni fashion show. I am doing the makeup um, and everything so today's going to be a long day and I need to get ready so I'm just going to be doing my makeup and eating and then I'm going to go to the train station and leave. Um, I'll take you around with me, so, yeah. Hope you guys are doing alright, by the way. I'm just in the lift now, getting out of my flat, and I'm ready. I've done my makeup. I used the makeup floor. I use the Makeup Revolution Iconic palette, which is basically the Naked palette. And um, what's happening? And on my lips I'm wearing Rimmel Asia, which you probably can't really see very well because it's really dark right now. I just had a quick breakfast. But it's still really dark right now. It's starting to light up now, but so hashtag dedication. Yeah, you can see my lips a little bit better here. I can't even see you guys because of the sun. Um, I'm in London now and I'm going to the event and it's so bright. So it's a nice day though. It's pretty warm, so let's go find this venue. Hello Kylie. Thank you. Yeah, amazing. Thank you so much for, for coming and chatting to us. I think everyone is so excited to see you. Look how many phones there are. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I'm all over everyone's social media right now. <laughs> Hashtag Kylie Jenner. So Have you really only been once before? Once before. Oh wow. And are you here for long or? No, it's a busy day and then I leave tomorrow morning, so <sighs> crazy. Wow, okay, well, let's talk a little bit about Nip and Fab. So, how did you first come across the brand? Um, it was actually at a photo shoot. Someone was using the product and they were using the Dragon's Blood fix and then I just fell in love. Yeah, I've used that before as well. It's pretty amazing. It's pretty really good. Um, now, you're a massive style icon over here in the UK. How does that feel to have so much attention on what you're wearing? It's a lot of the pressure. pressure. It's, I've used the same stylist for like my whole life, Monica Rose, so I'm always with her, like getting rid of all my clothes and starting over. But Kim and Kanye, yeah. their style, I'm obsessed. Kim's always like in the latest and new stuff, so I always look to her for advice and stuff. Amazing, yeah, it's pretty pretty good family to have style wise. I know. <laughs> How about you, Maria? Have you had do you have a, a style icon? Kylie. <laughs> I like that. Also, P.S. We've all kind of dressed in black. We didn't plan this, by the way. Red lips. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm a feeling part of the crew. I'm enjoying it. We were talking shoes all this morning, so. Oh, hello. I did not see these. These are banging. Okay, so we're talking about style, but can you guys both tell me uh, your definition of beauty? Um, definition of beauty. I mean, I always think, I mean, outer-wise, like every time I see girls, yeah, I always yeah. think they're like, most beautiful when like they're not really wearing anything like dewy skin and stuff i'm always like oh, you're so pretty like when there's a lot of makeup and stuff which i'm obsessed with makeup so i'm not gonna not wear any but i think it's really pretty when i see other girls like wearing no makeup yeah stuff. like fresh face yeah, yeah. how about you Maria? yeah I, I totally agree with kylie it's all about effortless beauty glowing skin and a healthy lifestyle yeah just mm -hmm. basics um, so Kylie, can you tell us what your skincare routine is? Like, I want to know everything. You know, what, how long you spend on it at night? Do you have like a routine in the morning? Because okay. you have such great skin. What's Thank the secret? You. 
um, Lip and Fab won, and they generously filled my whole hotel with like every product. So I've been go I'm a craze like using everything. But um, I don't know. I use a lot of scrubs. They're yoga scrubs. It's really amazing and lavender. I like to use it before bed because it like calms me. But um, good um, moisturizer is good. And then take your makeup off before you go to bed. Sunscreen on your hands and face. Oh, is that thing? Yeah. On your hands as well? Yeah, to keep, because you know, like, you can tell someone's age by their hands. Yeah, Chloe, yeah. Chloe, my older sister, always told me to put sunscreen on my hands. Noted. <laughs> so, yes. So how does having great skin make you feel? I mean, it makes me feel great, doesn't everybody? Who wants bad skin, you know? Yeah, it gives you confidence, I suppose. For sure. Yeah. And do you think it's important to eat healthy to achieve that skin? I mean, I think that's a huge part of it and a lot of water and stuff. But um, I always drink like pressed juice. I drink a lot of pressed juice, mm. like carrots and all that. I've there was this it. article recently about this girl who drank like an excessive amount of water for like a month straight or something, who like never really drank water in her life and she looks like 10 years younger. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, actually, because I did hear like three big liters of, I think three liters of water a day is yeah. supposed to be amazing for you, but that's a lot of toilet trips. So much water. <laughs> yeah. <That's a> lot. <laughs> <laughs> What's your sort of favorite day-to-day -day look? Um, I always usually do like the same lip color. <laughs> well, everyone thinks I have like this one specific lip color, but I have like 10 different nudes. So probably just like a nude lip color. Uh -huh. And I can't live without my strip lashes. And that's probably it. And, what, and do you have like a, a whole separate nighttime look or do you try and keep it the same? Um, I kind of keep it the same, but for night I usually add a glitter, a lot of glitter. I'm feeling the glitter. <laughs> yeah, it looks awesome. You. I can't stop looking thank at you. it. Handbags, okay. I'm dying to know <laughs> what is in your handbag. I mean, because mine is just like a load of crushed crisps and like some chewing on, pa <laughs> chewing on papers, I know, very glamorous. <laughs> So what are like, your, your handbag essentials? I know, my handbag isn't as neat as everyone probably thinks it is, but um, I have so many lip liners. I can't leave the house without lip liner. And then, um, what else do I have? Currently I have the um, Dragon's Blood Serum Hydrator. <coughs> and, because I love moisturizer. And you travel a lot as well, yeah. so you must get like, you must need to keep on top of it. Yeah. yeah, I always have like sunglasses just in case, and chapstick. Yeah, all that stuff. I love pampering days. Um, I usually just like either take a shower or bath for like two hours and like scrub my whole body, all my spray tan off, and then um, I don't know. Just like I love lotions. Again, this whole yoga thing, all these lotions are like amazing, and then. Um, I don't know, masks. Yeah. Just yeah. like how we just put my hair in coconut oil. Do you get much time to sort of sit back and chill? Yeah. I, I mean, it's quite, quite a hectic life yeah. need. It is kind of hectic, <laughs> but when I do, it's nice. Yeah. Well, I hope you get some more chill out time. Um, and before we go, just let us know what, what, what are you up to next? What am I up to next? I have a lot of fun stuff coming up this year. So that's kind of cool. I just. Um, just got, I'm moving out in a second. So that's awesome. My escrow closed today or something or yesterday. So that's really exciting. And then um, other than that, I don't really know. You okay. have to wait and see. So that was the event done, but I met Beauty by JJ there after the event, which was really, really good. She was so nice, but yeah, I'm gonna go home now. So I am back in my flat now after a train ride and um, I am now going to get my makeup and go to the uni fashion show so that I can do some makeup. I'm really tired. I'm just watching um, and I'm just watching Zoe's vlog on my phone right now. And We just did the fashion show. 
but I didn't get any clips of the actual fashion show because we were backstage and the time that we were backstage we were just like taking off makeup and doing the makeup yeah and there was there was no time to do the makeup anyway so there was no time to vlog at all but all the models were like saying because I was supposed to walk on the show as well as do the makeup I couldn't do both in the end so I just had to do the makeup but uh, I walked in the end <laughs> I walked in the end a little bit more than walked you know did a little pose little pose or three pose. and now we're going to get ready yeah. well we're gonna eat first yeah, eat and then get ready because there's an after party so you know we're gonna do our makeup I've just taken off my makeup I'm a little bit dressed but not quite so so I've just sort of taken off my makeup not really not really that well but I'm just gonna redo it because I've been wearing that makeup all day and I want to look nice for this night out theme for the party is geek or freak and I'm gonna be a freak so like a sexy freak so I'm just gonna do my makeup done okay Oh my god, it's literally Sunday, okay? It's literally Sunday, okay? And it's just three minutes to 7 a.m. And I've had a nap in the kitchen. <laughs> I like a, an, a one hour nap in the kitchen. Didn't even realize I was slept. I was sleeping in the beanbag chair. And I've just taken off my makeup and I'm now going to bed. See you later. Bye.